the Louis Vuitton fashion show yesterday in Paris. Let's specifically talk about our own superstars. We're talking about the whiskey, Bonner Boy, Rema, Adekule Gold, and the beautiful queen, Thames. We were all invited to that show, to that fashion show yesterday in Paris. Well, big up to all our superstars because we are definitely sure that they were the stars of the day. You know, we have so many other stars, way bigger stars there, but Africa stars were the stars of the day. You know, they were mainly, mainly focused on because of their swag. And let me make this clear. They all killed it. They all killed their looks. They were all wearing Louis Vuitton. It was a Louis Vuitton show and you are not allowed, at least out of respect, not allowed to rock any other outfit because it's a Louis Vuitton show. So they, they were all rocking Louis Vuitton's design. Nothing, none other thing is allowed to be rocked at that particular show. Well, of course, let's start with Wiz. Oh boy. Wiz really, really killed it. Of course, you see that uh, short pant, the black, and of course, the white pants, looking like uh, a primary school student who just recently passed out. Man, check out the white collar shirt the wore and the specs. Damn. Wiz, for me, okay, I don't want to like put preference on anybody, but I love Wiz outfit the better and Rema as well of course you see the uh the uh the jean up and down it wore the blue jean up and down also the jacket he decided to just uh use to just uh blend the whole outfit so that is the, my most second best look there and then the third is a uh, good of course you see the black the black uh, top and the black pants over baggy pants and also the jacket he, he wore the Louis Vuitton uh, unlimited uh, jacket he wore and also you see Bonner Boy there Udugu himself who decided to come there as a freedom fighter you know with his shirt with his uh, chest wide open and of course you see the hat I don't know why he just decided to be wearing the hat nowadays I think he want to signify that particular act to make sure you know before you know it now people will start rocking this the same hat well uh it was actually absolutely good look yesterday and uh, of course you know the beautiful queen thames with the all white and uh the brown little bit with home back sorry i cannot specifically tell you the 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 model of those outfits they wore but i can tell you they were all louis vuitton it was a louis vuitton fashion show out of respect, you are not supposed to wear any other brand. So they all wore oh, yeah. the everything. Everything. Oh, so that was what they were all wearing. But except uh, Odogu himself, I don't know the cap. The the cap he was wearing because it was a recently designed car by him. I just decided to be wearing. I don't know why, but uh, I think, like I said before, I want to you know make it is a. a uh, a symbol, a symbol. Well, that is uh, nice, guys. But like I've said before, Nigeria superstars were the stars of the day. And most especially, all of them just had that camera on them, man. All of them had that camera on them. We have so many big superstars. The other Africa superstars who were also there, like uh, Uncle Waffles, have so many incredible stars, like. Uh, uh, Farrah Williams, who is part of the production, so many other people, guys. But and specifically about our own Nigeria superstar, who is definitely making us proud. And the event is uh, invitation only. You know, you cannot just come to that event without being invited. Of course, they may have invited a lot of persons who weren't able to make it there. You know, who weren't able to make it, but. If you are not invited, you cannot come. So don't make jokes on anybody. Huh? 
they still have Gucci, Prada, and every other fashion. Like your own fashion. Your own fashion. And the other person. I know some of you will be making fun of so many crazy persons now, making ideas. You know, Nigeria matter now. They will definitely call the video new. David, I've seen all, all those mimicking videos already about David Do not be at that fashion show. I never knew it was that a big deal. This is a fashion show. They sell clothes. So why why are you guys making fun of uh, David Do now? Come on, man. We have seen David Do uh, get invited in many fashion shows. So please, 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 please drop David Do, man. Don't, don't make fun. Don't talk much on... Uh, David Do. There, are, there were so many other persons there, like Sandra C. Of course, that's one of my favorite uh, musicians uh, as at this moment. So many. So please drop it. Drop it. And uh, we saw how Whiskey, like I think this among the few times to see Whiskey actually passionately uh, working with his girlfriend, Jada. Baby Mama Jada, who, rep, who, is re, who is reportedly still pregnant, pregnant with their third child, you know? It might be a girl, though, but uh, that's a uh, whiskey for you. They were so nice looking together. I think that was like the, the the real focus of the day. Like, if you check the Twitter now, you see how people are buzzing about the whole Jada and whiskey uh, stuff. You know, it's really crazy. We have, they have, it's really, really few times we have actually seen them like that, so... It was really nice to see it. And also we see we saw Rema and Bonner Boy really getting it, kicking it and uh, talking to really to an extent, really, really long extent to see where we saw how Rema was giving uh, Bonner Boy his ass accolades, you know, praising Bonner Boy telling Bonner Boy all sorts of things. They know exactly what they were doing, but it was all love between them. No beef, no tension, nothing, nothing. Uh, Bonaboy was even surprised that Rema was there because he never knew Rema was there. Bonaboy was absolutely really, really surprised that Rema got invited. It was a really good one. And Rema was giving Bonaboy's accolades like praises and everything. And you know, Rema wants, Rema is also passing through his, uh, his crazy thought now because he just recently left uh, Marvin Record. He's now the boss of his own now. And he's about to drop an album, uh, a song, I don't know, but, uh, he deleted all his Instagram posts and he just posted recently, so we don't know exactly what we are expecting from Rema. You know, he has moved through this transition. I don't know, guys. I don't know. So let us list it. You know, Rema name is a really big brand. Big, 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 big brand. We are not talking about some other. It's a really big brand, you know. Big brand down there. So it's like we might just include it, include him to among the top uh, three. I might just uh, still add the Rema there to be the top four, you know. Now, I and I, and if you had a Saka there as well, and Adekule Gold really, really killed it. You know, I was never expected to see Adekule Gold, but we kind of like underestimate the power, the star power of Adekule Gold and how good he is and how influential he is. So, sorry Adekule Gold for underestimating you. You were, you, you were really, really looking nice there. City alongside Thames, you know, Thames the Queen, who recently dropped an album. Damn, that album currently have sold more than 16,000 copies in USA only. Only in USA and the other part of the other part of the world, of course, you know, Thames is actually really, really doing it. And they're big up to Thames, the Queen, the only Queen that was invited. I think they should invite more of these girls, you know. I think Arasta may definitely be invited, but Arasta is currently toying with uh, Chris Brown, you know. And again, not just only that, uh, Yodogu himself, who is there, you know, showing off, opening his chest. As one time, he had to pull off the Louis Vuitton shirt and showing it off his chest, you know, just to really feel free. And later on, himself and Whiskey ended up in club, the same club together, and they were chilling and uh, enjoying themselves. No beef, you know. We kind of like bring beef into this kind of uh, stuff. There was no beef at all. They were all enjoying themselves. They partied and it was all nice. Nothing at all. Yeah, it's just a fashion show, but it's just that we are particularly about our own artists and how they killed it. Because we in Nigeria, 
we know how to praise our own artists and we are the one that also know how to criticize our artists as well so let us drop the critics this time and let us just stick to the praise you know that let us stick to the praise hmm?